What an unbelievable environment in the arena with the World Heavyweight Championship on the line. You can forget about pinfalls. You can forget about submissions and disqualifications and countouts. King, there's only one way to win this last man standing match, and that is to literally, physically, destroy your opponent until he cannot stand for the referee's 10 count. And I know both of these individuals, Cole, it's going to take some doing to get either one of these guys that incapacitated. That is the question here tonight. Which man, Shawn Michaels or Triple H, will be able to survive the physical toll that this match is about to dish out? One thing we know about Shawn Michaels, Cole, is he loves those high-flying, high-risk moves. But the big word there is risk, King. Triple H can do some serious damage to Shawn Michaels' back if he catches HBK when he's most vulnerable in the air. Well, I'll tell you what, just watching the start here and the way these two men... to give a little bit of a psychological advantage to Triple H, the cerebral assassin. His presence alone is psyching out Shawn Michaels. Uh-oh. Right? Look out here. Here comes the game. Wait a minute. Triple H locked over the top rope. And now it's rally time for Shawn Michaels. Watch out. What's he going to do? Oh, no. Right on our table. And now it is show-off time. He's down, and now the official begins the count. Triple H is chipping away. He anticipated that move perfectly. Nice reversal there. Ow! Watch it! That's it. He's done. Shawn Michaels has always had great success at the Royal Rumble. In 97, he beat Psycho Sid to win the World Heavyweight title. Triple H! What a maneuver! Well, the great sports history of Philadelphia. I gotta be honest. I hope this is it, King. These guys have done so much harm to each other. As the attacker here, here we go. The officials counting again. Will it be for the last time? The physicality of this match is off the chart. I just hope that no matter what happens, these competitors... If that doesn't do it, then what will? Triple H is the cerebral assassin. And you now it's gut check time. This has been so exhausting. And he gets escorted back through the ropes. One offense. Shawn Michaels is showing at this point. Now back to the ring. Whoa! He's measuring. That's it. He's out. Uh-oh, look at that. Oh! And Triple A setting up Michaels here. Setting up Shawn Michaels. If he hits his pedigree, it's over. Oh! He hits the pedigree. Both of these men have been through such a brutal match here. The official on a count of four. Triple H making it back to his feet. What's Shawn Michaels, can he make it back to his feet before 10 k He's up, he's up! And the match continues. Oh. Chin music! And Shawn Michaels collapses, but the game is down and I think out. Shawn Michaels has got to somehow pull himself to his feet, take advantage here. Somehow roll into the cover. Can he do this? Can Shawn Michaels get up? Wait! There's the 10 count! The referee calls for the bell! What does this mean, Cole? Ladies and gentlemen, as both men were unable to answer the count of 10, the referee has declared that Triple H is still the World Heavyweight Champion. Oh my gosh.